Hi, I'm Lisa Bryant. I'm the artistic director here at Flat Rock Playhouse. And uh, we're thrilled to be participating in this amazing anniversary and this marathon of all of his great masterpieces, including Henry VI, part one. So Flat Rock Playhouse is the State Theater of North Carolina. We are entering our 64th year uh, in existence. Um, we produce musicals, plays. We have two spaces, our main stage space uh, seats about 500 and we have a downtown space called Playhouse Downtown on Main Street which seats 250 and a three-quarter thrust. Uh, plays, musicals, we also have a really robust Music on the Rock program where we have a series of tribute artists coming through. Uh, so we have everybody from the Beach Boys to Fleetwood Mac to Billy Joel and Elton John and the Eagles and on and on. Uh, and a really wonderful um, education program called Studio 52 that produces really fantastic family programming for uh, the amazing patrons in, in our city and in our region. So I love Shakespeare personally. Uh, uh, when I was in graduate school, I had the great pleasure of, of doing uh, a, a couple of his shows um, and, uh, you know, getting involved in the text and in the language is really a, a real treat um, and not the kind of text and language that we normally get to do around here is a more commercial theater. Um, so I know that my troupe is really excited about taking on this challenge, nervous, but excited. Uh, and we're just gonna have a really good time and we're really honored and feel quite privileged to be partnering with all of the other theaters who are participating in this wonderful event in honor of uh, one of the most important people in our collective um, theatrical history. Uh, we just really want to give a special thank you to Burning Coal Theatre Company for taking on this uh, tremendous project um, and for extending an invitation to all of us in the state to um, celebrate this remarkable person. Um, and uh, we, hope we, do it, we hope we do it justice. Christy, what is Henry VI Part One about? I have absolutely no idea. <laughs> Uh, so here we are in the development uh, office. This is Ashley and this is Allison. Ladies, uh, we have been uh, chosen to read Henry VI, Part One, for our Shakespeare um, contribution. Uh, can you please tell us what this play is about? Uh, I couldn't tell you if you gave me a million dollars. Allison? No clue. Hi again. Um, so here are our set magicians. This is Chris and this is Dennis. Um, and as you guys know, we're participating in the Shakespeare Marathon in April, and we were selected not only to kick off the entire event and go first, but we were selected to read the play uh, Henry VI, Part One. Can you guys please tell us what that play was about? It's very historical. <laughs> it's educational, and everyone should come and see it. It's about Henry. The Sixth. Like... Part One. But only Part One of his life. <laughs> Okay, this is gonna be amazing, guys. Okay, hi, I'm here with our box office and group sales folks. This is Daniel and this is Pam, and as you guys know, we are participating in the Shakespeare Marathon in April, and our theater was chosen to read Henry VI, Part One. Can you please tell everyone what Henry VI, Part One is about? I cannot. I have no idea. <laughs> this is gonna be so good. Uh, hi, everybody, this is Jim and Kevin and Susie. Um, guys, we are participating, as you know, in April in the Shakespeare Marathon, and we were selected to read Henry VI, Part One. Can uh, you guys tell us what Henry VI, Part One is about? I can't even tell you who Henry was. It's about a king, Henry. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll uh, we'll see what happens. What's Henry VI, Part One about? Oh. Oh. Thank you, Max. That is the most helpful answer we've had all day. <laughs> <laughs>